freshman state representative Stephen did not leave his new office is totally empty. But sitting in front of his new desk, the Nutley's mind is full of plans. It really is an opportunity to make some changes if you, in, in your city, in my case, the city of Fitchburg. Yes, it is always all about the city of Fitchburg ever since the Nutley started his campaign in February 2006. His son, Marcus, organized the campaign for him. When we first started this, it was just my father and I. This was a grassroots campaign. In nine months, the Nutley knocked on more than 10,000 people's doors in the city. There was a woman who lived on top of a hill, very secluded area. Never in her 40 years in Fitchburg has she ever seen an elected official. But the Nutley went up there and knocked on her door. Ever since then, they've developed the friendships. And that little example, you know, grow, grew into something bigger. The Nutley is a strong believer in door-to-door -door campaign, but not everybody buys this idea. And he literally chased me out of the back end. Get out! I didn't say anything I said. However, the door-to-door -door grassroots campaign does successfully bring the former Fitchburg city councilor to the Massachusetts State House. Now what? The city of Fitchburg has some challenges in, this, in the public safety area. I'm hoping to make some... Uh, make some inroads in, in improving that, that situation in the city. Representative Di Natalie is trying to bring more community policing money to Fitchburg. However, according to the fiscal year 2008 state budget, Fitchburg will get $39 million for local aid, which is not much more than last year's $38 million. It seems this new representative still gets a long way to go. Tawin Sen for BUTV10 in Fitchburg.